क्वेश्चन नंबर 171 द ट्रैक्ट ऑफ माइलिनेटेड नर्व फाइबर्स दैट कनेक्ट्स द टू सेरिब्रल हेमिस्फीयर्स इन ह्यूमंस इज वर्मिस सेरिब्रल एक्वीडक्ट कॉर्पस कैलोजम क्रूरा सेरिब्राई स्टूडेंट्स द क्वेश्चन इज आस्किंग अबाउट द कनेक्शन ऑफ टू सेरिब्रल हेमिस्फीयर्स ऑप्शन नंबर 1 वर्मिस वर्मिस कनेक्ट्स टू सेरिब्रलर हेमिस्फीयर्स so that is incorrect option number 2 cerebral aqueduct cerebral aqueduct is present in the midbrain option number 3 corpus callosum that's the right answer this is the tract of nerve fibers which connects two cerebral hemispheres option number 4 crura cerebri this structure is also present in our midbrain so the correct answer becomes here option number 3 corpus callosum question number 172 The cranial nerve termed optic nerve is associated with ear, nose, eye, tongue. The question is asking about optic nerve. Students, the optic nerve is the main sensory nerve of eye and its function is provision of sight. So optic nerve is associated with eye. Let's look at the other options here. Option 1 ear. The main nerve associated with ear is auditory nerve. which is eighth cranial nerve second option nose the major nerves associated with nose are olfactory nerve which is your first cranial nerve then some branches of trigeminal nerves are also associated which is your fifth cranial nerve and option number 4 tongue major nerve associated with tongue is hypoglossal nerve which is 12th cranial nerve so the right answer here is option number 3 i which is associated with optic nerve which is a second cranial nerve answer is 3 question number 173 how many among the following are parasympathetic responses of the human body dilation of pupil in fear excessive perspiration in presence of enemy contracted state of sphincter of urinary bladder constriction of air passages like bronchioles in case of allergy choose the correct option 1 3 2 4 the question is asking about the parasympathetic responses of the human body students let's look at a dilation of pupil in fear the activation of parasympathetic nervous system would constrict pupil so this is incorrect whereas the activation of sympathetic nervous system would dilate pupil b excessive perspiration in presence of enemy which is related to sweat glands sweat glands are not innervated by parasympathetic system so won't have any effect on them whereas stimulation of parasympathetic nervous system would result in increased perspiration so it would stimulate perspiration so this is also incorrect because it's a sympathetic response option c contracted state of sphincter of urinary bladder this is also wrong urinary bladder with the activation of parasympathetic nervous system urinary bladder contracts so sphincter would relax and vice versa here it relaxes the urinary bladder so that makes it incorrect D constriction of air passages like bronchioles in case of allergy parasympathetic system would constrict the air passages making them narrower hindering breathing whereas sympathetic system would widen the air passages to facilitate breathing so this is correct so out of these items only one is a parasympathetic response of the human body the right answer here would be option number 1 question 174 the brain tail exits from the skull through dash into vertebral column choose the option that fills the blank correctly foramen of monro foramen magnum foramen of magendi foramina of lushka let's look at option 1 foramen of monro foramen of monro connects lateral ventricles of brain with the third ventricle at the midline of the brain option number 2 foramen magnum 
This is the largest foramen in skull and the brain tail exits from the skull through foramen of magnum. So this is the right answer here. Let's look at option 3 and 4 for Amen of Majinde and Lushka. These provide route for passage of CSF from metaseal into the subarachnoid space. So the correct answer here is option number 2 for Amen Magnum. Question 175. Select the structure or region that is incorrectly paired with its function. Amygdala converts short-term memory to long-term. Cerebellum, locomotory coordination of the body. Medulla oblongata controls respiration and cardiovascular reflexes. Hypothalamus, production of releasing and inhibitory hormones. Option number 1. Amygdala. Amygdala is almond shaped structure of brain which controls the mood especially anger and rage. It's paired with converting short term memory to long term. This is the function of hippocampus. So this is incorrectly paired. Option number two cerebellum. Locomotor coordination of the body, this is right. It is very important to coordinate locomotor activities. So this is correctly paired. Medulla oblongata has centers for respiration and cardiovascular reflexes. This is also right. Hypothalamus, production of releasing and inhibitory hormones. This is absolutely right. So the correct answer here would be option number one, which is incorrectly matched.